jukebox? Are you kidding me? We can do much better than this. Hey everyone, Dan here from the Diamond Minecart and welcome to another Minecraft mod review where today I'm going to be showcasing the cassette player mod which allows you to craft cassettes and record your favourite tunes onto them so you can listen to them while you play Minecraft. Now I think that I've managed to get all the features together but it was fairly difficult as this is another Japanese mod that I found but all of the awesome and main functionality is there. Anyway, less of that and more recipes and we've got a couple of chests to look through as always. So the first thing you're going to need is a way to play your cassettes before you craft them probably a bit of a backwards way of doing it but oh well there's two ways of um crafting the cassette players this is a straight up cassette player and you need two redstone repeaters and two iron ingots to make the mcmp1 and to upgrade to the more modern era you need to make an mcmp101 which is more of a digital kind of tape player then you need two obsidian in replacement of the iron ingots from the previous recipe. So this one here is a more traditional way of playing tapes and this one is a bit more modern. And I'll show you the two features of those in a second. And then you also need a way to record onto your cassettes because otherwise you're just going to be hearing silence. <laughs> so um, to make this you need three iron ingots in this pattern, a diamond in the center and three redstone repeaters along the bottom to make yourself a cassette recorder which looks something like this which is pretty cool, pretty cool. <laughs> so on to the next chest and you're going to be able to craft your cassettes. Now to make those you need two wooden planks and two string will make a single blank cassette tape. So the white ones are your blank ones and are just called cassette tapes. So those are the ones you're going to pop into your cassette recorder to be able to record onto them so let's grab that for now and then you're also going this is a cassette changer um you're going to need three iron ingots and five wooden planks to make it and i'm not this is the thing that i'm not entirely sure about so uh just bear with me on that one and you can actually make different colored cassettes so to do that you use all the different dyes so here i've just used the example of lapis lazuli you just put a blank cassette tape Bear in mind that you can't use a normal cassette tape, you need to use a blank one first and then record onto that. It will make a cassette tape blue and you can do that with pretty much every colour in the game. So as you can see I've got a red one here, you just use the different dyes and wools and stuff and you'll be able to get different colours. But to change a dyed cassette back to a normal blank cassette, you just put bone meal and the coloured cassette into a crafting table and it will make a blank one. So now, what you want to know is how to record your own sounds. So, on the screen I'm just going to quickly flash up the file path for where you need to put your mp3 files or .ogg files for the songs that you want to put into your Minecraft. And what you need to do first is go over to your cassette recorder and where you've put those files in you can see I've got some here. I've got two by the awesome Kevin McLeod because I can't have any copyright and stuff so... <clears throat> It's just going to have to be this, but uh, they're really cool songs actually, so yeah. What you do is you grab your blank cassette tape and put it in this thing that looks like a sad face. Oh, that's funny. But you put it in here, you select your tune, so let's go for 8-bit Dungeon Boss, and you'll see it goes up like a furnace, and it will start to create your cassette, and it'll start recording onto your blank cassette. For those of you that aren't around when cassettes are around, this is a very tedious way of making and burning cds as they are nowadays now on to mp3s and ipods and stuff so yeah <laughs> it's pretty retro but minecraft is 8 bit so it matches <laughs> so now as you can see this now has the title of the track below the cassette tape name so this is an actual cassette tape so now how do you play these things now first up you have the mc mp1 which you right click and it will just start straight up playing the 8-bit dungeon boss theme as you can hear in the background right now so this is a traditional one you can see the little sprite has changed to play and when i right click it stops and it will start to play again so that's really cool and the way it does this is when you're in your inventory the top line will play first second well the hot bar will play first so if you've got lots of cassettes lined up along the bottom here then you'll be able to play them in order and it will just run through like a normal cassette and then it will take the first line of your inventory as the second third fourth etc but if you want more control over your sounds let's go for this which is the mc mp 101 which looks a lot better and allows you to flick through your tracks, shuffle them and loop them as well, which is really awesome. It's the upgrade for the MCMP1. So if you press play, it will play your 8-bit dungeon boss theme. So that is amazing. You can have all kinds of cassettes in your inventory and hotbar and you'll be able to go through all your different songs, cycle through them, stop, play, repeat, shuffle and just pretty much have whatever you want in your Minecraft. 
And just a quick note, guys, I have just figured out what the cassette changer does. So if I go into my right click, it will bring up this GUI. And what you can do is it's a pretty much saves your space in your inventory. So when you're using the MCP 101, you can put the cassette tapes in these orders and you can label each cassette changer as well. So it contains two songs. I can put tunes in it and it will be labeled tunes so i could put different genres of music in there and when you use the mcp 101 it will come up in this order and it just pretty much um organizes all your cassettes so it has a lot of cassettes room in here you can get lots of these in your inventory and hotbar and it's just a really easy way to store all your stuff so yeah thought i'd mention that as i just figured it out <laughs> so i think that this mod is amazing it's really clever and it's just a really cool way to have your songs in your minecraft playing away in the background without having to open itunes and stuff and it's just a, a cool way to integrate your playlist into Minecraft by recording them by hand and doing all that cool stuff. So that's pretty much it for this. Thanks for watching guys. This has been the Cassettes mod and if you did like the look of it then please do check the description below to find the mod creators forum post but again do beware as it is all in Japanese. Anyway if you did also enjoy this video then please click that like button share it with your friends on Facebook and Twitter and if you're new to the channel then please subscribe by hitting that button in the screen or the one just above the video. So thanks again for watching guys. I hope you did enjoy the mod, please do check it out and I'll see you all in the next video.